<coughs> Hello YouTube, welcome back to my tutorial. Uh, today in my tutorial I will discuss about one of the Linux command which is very common. Uh, I'll talk about the AWK awk command. So this is my channel guys. Uh, if you haven't subscribed it yet, please subscribe it because I, I, I always try to simplify things using my tricks and uh, I always give you the best way to learn shell scripting, uh, Perl, Python and other languages. Okay. So it will be very, it will be really uh, beneficial for you. Okay. So uh, without wasting any time, let's go ahead and start with the first session of AWK. So I'll be giving uh, you know continuous session on awk or command so awk is really a very nice command if you open the uh, tutorial if you open the manual page of awk it is it says it is used for pattern scanning and processing language okay so it mostly is used to uh, to use to uh, you know uh, uh, scan a file mostly you know if you have a very big file it can be used to uh, cut certain portion of it and uh, uh, get some relevant information out of it okay so uh, you know there is a it's a big uh, you can see everything is written here so let's go ahead and uh, you know try the, the best way to understand it is to to explore it using uh, some practicals okay so uh, so you, if you see uh, i have created some uh, dummy file let's say i have a file called uh, some file okay so i have kept a random data in it and we'll try to manipulate it okay so mostly if you if you take any file and uh, if you do like this awk and then uh, it has a certain syntax for it awk and then the pattern and then the file name okay so here i am giving as the entire um, uh, I want to print the file so let's say I want to say print I won't I won't give any condition here and I will simply print the file so okay so let's say uh, okay I have to close this so this will print the entire file okay so I will incrementally will and try to understand all because you have you must have seen or command before and you must have definitely gone through other tutorials for awk command but trust me uh, this tutorial will definitely help you learn something new today okay and uh, i'll definitely use some the easiest way to understand it okay so uh, so print command usually print the entire record so if you want to print uh, the entire uh, record if you want to print the entire record so you can give dollar zero so it will print the entire record okay if you want to print the first first column it you have to use dollar one likewise you can use dollar two to print the second column okay what about i want to print the last column of the file so to print the last column of the file this can be a little bit tricky because most people don't know this so uh, the last column can be printed using the nf command which is again a built-in variable nf is also a built-in variable okay uh, okay so this is one this is the command which can be used to, like, like most time most of the time we want to print the last column okay then in that case it becomes difficult yeah because we don't know like let's say you will say okay i'll cut it and uh, i'll uh, you know print the last column but you don't know how many let's say if let's say in this file you have one two three four columns so you will say i will print i will i'll put like this dollar four so it will print the last column but but if you don't know how many columns are there uh, let's say it's eight or nine columns you don't know so in that case this can help when you can directly print the last column okay what what if uh, what if i want to print what if I want to print the second last column? How do I do that? Okay, because that's also a requirement sometime. Okay, so let's say I try minus one. Okay, you have to put it into bracket. Okay, so if you do like this, it will print the last, second last column. Let's compare it. Okay, 
dollar zero will print the entire record so second last column which is marks column okay so you can see i am printing the second last column well, what if i want to print the 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 third last column i can use minus two is it yeah definitely i can use the likewise you know if let's say there are 10 columns you want to print uh, 10th column you can do using dollar uh, nf you want to print the ninth column you can do using dollar brackets nf minus one if you want to print the eighth column you can do nf minus two and so on okay so that can be helpful okay what if i want to uh, look okay, there are many cases when the separator is not space you know the field separator is not space then what will you do let's say here we have a, a colon okay so what if i want to use a, a, a field separator definitely you can do uh, 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 use a, self, uh, a field separator so let's say I'll, I'll, I'll not use any data i'll use ls minus ltr itself so if i use a uh, law let's say i want to just i want to use a field separator so i want Arc minus f is used to uh, to to um, to incorporate the, the 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 colon the the field separator so you can give any field separator you want let's say i'm using this one so here i can give print print dollar one okay so what it will print it will print the first first field uh, separated by colon okay so you see uh, everything is printed before colon in each row you see if i print dollar two it is printing everything uh, which is uh, separated by colon in the second column okay so this is this minus f option can be used for for field separator okay let's say uh, okay so uh, this way you can use it as a, as a field separator okay let's go ahead uh, and print the entire file again okay so let's say i want to uh, i want to uh, i want to get all the all the uh, guys all the all the all the people in this file where uh, where who are males okay how do i do that who are males okay let's say i will let's first print the file and then I want to get only the people who are males okay so how do i do that uh, let's say so uh, what i have to do is i have to print awk okay awk and then we have to give a pattern so let's say dollar dollar uh, dollar two dollar four obviously four is the sex column dollar four equal to male i think it should work no okay okay um dollar four okay uh let's say uh, if you can you can give pattern like this so uh one second okay um, so you have the pattern here okay let's just take a look at my own website so what I want to print? Okay, so here it is. So I, I was giving the the this thing wrong. Okay. So okay. So instead of this slash, it will be this slash. Okay. So you see, I am getting only the males. Okay. So I am getting M as the fourth column. So how, what if I can compare the the only the column itself? Okay so what i can do is i can do instead of equal you can do you can give this yeah what is it uh, the tilde and then the pattern okay so you see what i'm doing is i'm extracting the the fourth column and i'm comparing it with male so only the male are being listed okay what if i want to get only the girls out of it i'll give female so only the females are listed right so this way you can compare a particular column with a certain pattern and you can you can get it from the file okay so if you want to search for a particular pattern you can give here like let's say 
let's say raj so it will print only that so awk and then the pattern so you have to specify the pattern in between the this uh, what do you call forward slash okay yeah so this is how you can search for a particular string okay what if i uh, i want to find a column i want to find a row where dollar one is equal to dollar uh, two is equal to dollar dollar uh, three is it possible okay you see i can do that so you see the th second column is equal to third column so you have to specify dollar two equal to dollar three it's the condition so any any string you are specifying you have to specify in between the the this uh, forward slash okay so this is how you can this is the next thing to know okay so what else so um, this way and um, next thing is that let's say you want to uh, let's say i am i want to print the fourth column okay so uh, print print dollar 4 okay let's say okay i am getting dollar 4 what if i want to uh, you know um, remove the duplicate values so let's say i want to only get the the unique values okay i don't want to duplicate values so what you can do is you can again use awk and then what you can do is to remove the duplicate values there is a command that can be used so okay so awk dollar zero in the array and th this pattern if you apply this so it will uh, okay let's see okay so you see it is only printing the the unique uh, data there is no duplicate values so what it is doing is it is uh, taking dollar zero is already in the array so it's not in the array then only it's printing so it is taking the values and only printing the unique values if it is already uh, there in the array it's not printing okay so this way you can remove the duplicate data okay yeah so okay fine um, so that's all guys i'll come back with another tutorial let's not uh, you know elongate this uh, tutorial longer so i will uh, make another tutorial on awk and we'll come back to you so this will be uh, so today what we discussed is we print the columns first column second column the last column the second last column we we talked about the fill separator using the minus capital f we we talked about searching using the string okay we talked about how to print the second last line and likewise you know, we, we talked about how to remove the duplicate values okay and we talked about how we can uh, you know if there's dollar two which is like second column is equal to dollar uh, second uh, third column how we can print on that condition okay so that's all in this tutorial uh, I'll, let's uh, i'll get back to you with another tutorial on this and uh, please subscribe my channel thanks for watching bye bye